Highland Canine Training, going over this week's video of the week. Uh, and this week's video, we're going to be going over clicker training, how to use the clicker, how we charge the clicker, and how to implement the clicker in our obedience training. The clicker is a tool that we use, and it's used to mark the precise moment when a dog has done the desired behavior that we've requested. So when they've done that behavior, we click. And the click signifies to the dog that a reward is forthcoming. So how we get it started is we use a number of different equipment. We use the clicker. We also use a leash. And what we'll do is we'll have our dog attached to the leash. We'll have a bag of treats, something that is very rewarding to your dog that they do desire. And we're going to click, treat, click, treat, click, treat. Every time that we click, we want to make sure that we reinforce our dogs with a treat. Um, in this video, I'll be using hot dogs. And so every time I click, my dog is going to be getting a hot dog. One of the most effective ways that you can practice using a clicker and improving your timing is with a tennis ball. What you'll want to do is have the clicker, have a tennis ball that does have some good bounce in it, and every time the ball touches the ground, you want to click that precise moment. You can also practice this by throwing the ball up in the air, and when the ball reaches its highest point, you can also click. When you start to feel comfortable with clicking, uh, when the tennis ball touches the ground, you can start to click faster. And how you do this is just let the ball continue to bounce. The bounces will become shorter in duration and time in between them. And so you can improve your clicking. Once your timing has improved and you've practiced this a number of times with the tennis ball, you want to start charging your dog to the clicker. And how we do that is we'll take our dog, we'll have her or him on their leash, the clicker in hand, and some treats beside you that your dog finds valuable to them. What you'll want to do is click and feed your dog. Click, feed your dog. So every time that you click, you're going to feed a treat. And how you want to practice this is maybe do it a couple times a day for short duration. So maybe practice it for two minutes at a time. But the important thing is to practice it as often as you can. And what you'll notice is that when your dog is fully charged, and this may take a week, it may take a little bit longer, your dog will start to turn their head to you every time that they hear that click. Because in their mind, the click now means I'm about to get a treat. So I'm going to click every time before I give Willow her reinforcement. And in this case, I'm using little cut-up pieces of hot dog. Now, when you apply this to your dog's obedience, what you'll do is if you tell your dog to sit, when the, the moment that their bottom touches the ground, you're going to click uh, to let them know that they've given you the proper behavior that you're wanting. And then you're going to feed them their treat. Okay. Okay. Sit. Hopefully this video has given you a greater understanding of clicker training and how it's used. If you have any questions or concerns, you can visit our website at www.highlandk9.com and stay tuned for our video next week.